freaking Tuesday. Hope everybody had a great Memorial freaking weekend. If you saw the schedule for the week, then you know one of the offs for today is gonna be pop puffing. But not first off. The biggest challenge for me vlogging every day is time management. Any kind of downtime honestly needs to be utilized properly. Well, Verona, Richard, and I were talking last night and we came up with a pretty good idea that might help me out while I'm in this area. Stop sign! I upload at their place while I'm out here and while I'm waiting for that vlog to upload, I do some work around the house. Wait for it. One last time. All right. While that is freaking uploading, let's get to first off. That huge pile of wood needs to go right here. Throughout the week while I'm waiting for vlogs to upload, continue to make some progress on the pile. First load's ready. Should be good. Well, our tires are a little flat. We're gonna put some air in the tires. There we go. Just like that. Well, back to work. That was load three. After load five, I'm gonna start organizing them in a very specific type of organization. Load number five. Almost got killed. That was close. Let's start freaking organizing. Or stacking up some logs if you want to get right down to it. Just 25 more loads will be good. I'm gonna knock out like five more loads. Richard and Verona actually invited me over for dinner. So I don't know if I'm gonna get to the main off today, the boat buffing, but that means tomorrow I need to go freaking crazy on it. So I guess it's a wood stacking kind of day. Ooh, the lighting's all different. I don't wanna make you guys jealous, but I just had some home cooking that was to die for. Beer. Barbecue chicken, cornbread, corn cob, potato salad. I just scared the chickens. It was amazing. Anyways, I don't want to make you hungry, or maybe maybe that's cool if I do. It's like 7 o'clock. I'm definitely not going to get to boat buffing today, but I can try to just keep knocking out this wood stacking log moving situation. It's time to freaking organize this shiznit. If you're wondering why the audio is different, it's because I'm using a different camera. The camera that shoots for 30 minutes at one time, instead of my other one, my main shooter, that shoots at 10 minute intervals at one time. <sighs> the 
the loads are stacked. Ah, good thing I had gloves. Really did a number. That's how you get a sliver. Well, enjoy your new home. Your brothers and sisters will be joining you when I get around to it. Yeah, I'm talking to you over there, you little shits. Well, Richard, it's time to feed the chickens Cheerios? Cheerios. Apparently chickens love Cheerios. A little late night dessert. Get them whole grains. They're a little freaked out of me, so I'm new to them. See if I can't seduce them with my Cheerios. You know you want it. Take it from my hand. Come on. Take the cheer. Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Almost bit my finger off. Want them? No? <laughs> oh, they're kind of stale. Yeah. You knew that, didn't you? Why we feed them the oh, you feed them when they're stale. <laughs> now I get it. You didn't tell me that. Yeah, they're still true. That's pretty good. I don't think you knew I was going to eat them, though. No, I didn't. I didn't figure it out. <laughs> Cheerio feast. Hello, Wishbone. You smell like bird crap. Well, Verona gave me some freaking leftovers. Packed me a whole lunch or breakfast or whenever I decide to eat it. Thank you so much, Verona. I have missed some home cooking. Oh my gosh. The food we had tonight. It made me miss my mama. And at the same time, it made me thankful that I know Verana. Because now, Verana, I'm gonna be coming over all the time for some home cooked meals. This wasn't from tonight. I actually got a sliver a few weeks ago, right in the crevice of my. Long story short, this finger, it's infected by a freaking sliver, got in the crevice of this finger. So for the next few days, I'm wrapping it through some antibiotic ointment something or another triple anti triple antibiotic ointment on that bad boy it's wrapped so you know what the heck and why I'm wearing it also possibly the first question you might have did I get the sliver out I tried my best and it still hurts so maybe not I can't see anything physically I just realized that I've been back at the marina living in wishbone for over two weeks and I still haven't brought my pillow from my Jeep into my freaking sailboat. How does a person do that? I've been sleeping without a pillow. Honestly, I don't even think about it. It's after midnight, so I won't see you guys tomorrow. I'll see you in like five hours. All right, everybody, have a great day. I hope you enjoyed your weekend and you're probably back at work now and anyways I hope you had a good day or night or whatever one sheep two sheep three sheep four sheep one sheep I just heard a fish jump <laughs>